Swap W. Making money smart. Today, I want to talk about a little bit different subjects from the ty types of uh, topic that I've been going with you about, such as completing offers for money, uh, such as um, blogging to, to make a profit, or affiliated uh, programs by helping your affiliates, etc. etc. Today, I want to talk to you a little bit about some important topics of our daily savings in general. What do most of us save our money? Even if you don't save, chances are you might have money in big banks that's uh, more friendly for residents. For, for residents. Usually meaning uh, the bigger friendly bank such as Bank of America, Washington Mutual, West Fargo, just to name a few that's out there running around today. Usually, what happens to these accounts that you and I open? Whether you have savings, money market, checkings account, the most interest rates that you can maximize on these accounts, assuming you have a very, very high um, amount of money in the bank, is probably actually less than 2%. I mean, when you go to extremes and you bargain with the bank, sometimes they can pull you up to 4%. But that is, surprisingly enough, not the max that you can get from banks. Today, I want to talk to you about these special banks that provide you a percentage or annual percentage yield or interest rate of 5% or above. The first one I want to introduce you is actually Washington Mutual itself through the internet banking system. They recently put, uh, opened these uh, campaign and it's 5%, definitely worth checking it out. Second, Citibank also comes out with a 5.05% annual percentage yield interest rate account. Now the cool thing about it is it provides $50 for people that sign up with them. However, there's a trick to it. You have to pay three consecutive payments with them. Third. Immigrant Direct. It's a very online based bank uh, where basically uh, just a regular savings account and provides 5.05% uh, in interest rates. Last, lastly, HSBC uh, provides 5.05% interest uh, percentage interest rate as well. Uh, they're a good and reputable bank on, a, on the web and uh, there you go. So those are the four banks that I would recommend looking into. Now, why do a lot of people don't look into banking their money or putting their savings on the internet? Because that is for the fear that a lot of times what these hackers would do is hack into your account and break in and somehow lure your money out of the bank and, and you know transact to their own uh, savings or whatever, offshore account, what have you. So it's very, very important to go to these reputable banks that I've talked about earlier. You know, Citibank's one of the biggest on the market, Washington Mutual, huge bank. Uh, Bank of, well, um, Citibank, well, one, one of the biggest ones around. Uh, HSBC, another huge bank as well. Lastly, Immigrant Direct is more online based. So, unless you're familiar with online based uh, banks, I think your best bet is to go with some bigger institution and that will maximize your profit. Now, the second thing I want to talk to you about is to transfer these money around. Does it cost money? Well, actually, it doesn't cost money. So as long as you give yourself some buffer, let's just say uh, you, for example, uh, that you use Bank of America, so, and you need to pay your rent, let's just say uh, hypothetically you need to pay your rent. So as long as you give a few days before that to wire that uh, bank, online banking account, that money into your account, um, it, 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 the transfer, the wild transfer will be free and you will be good to go. Give it a two, three day buffer, usually you'll be okay. Now I'm a big fan, besides saving, to diversify my, my uh, account or my portfolio. Um, like I've talked to you guys in the past, I've introduced you guys about Prosper.com. With good investments, you can make up to, from my experience, you know, you can make up to 14% uh, uh, annual percentage yield of interest. So it takes a lot of risk here and there, but your best bet is to probably go with what the group leader picks and uh, I will talk a little bit more detail in that in my blog today. So in terms of banks, be sure to go through those those uh, banks that I've talked about to maximize your uh, savings. So that will conclude with today's lesson.
Swap W. Making money smart. www.swapw.blogspot.com